Hopefully my dogs stop being assholes. Rough, rough. Are you streaming? My own brothers crazy. died tragically as well. Truth be told. Stop filming. All right, no. It was 1868, and me and my older brothers were pulling a tidy profit running cattle into Juarez, Mexico. One night after my brothers retired for the evening, I found a little poker game in a canteen with a couple of cowboys. And I just couldn't lose. I even won an old Spanish coin that had to be a hundred years old. Well... I was mighty pleased with myself the next morning as my brothers and I rode for Texas. But before we crossed the border, those cowboys caught up with us. It was Johnny Ringo, Roscoe Bob Bryant, and another asshole named Jim. They wanted their money back and everything else we had, including our lives, as those boys didn't want us coming for them later. Bob put that old Spanish coin in my mouth and said, I won't have it said that I left you with nothing, boy. Well, those horses bolted, and there we hung as those bastards rode away. The branch finally snapped under the weight of the three of us, but being my older brothers were bigger and heavier. They were already dead. And right then, I swore to myself that I would avenge them. Ringo, you know about. But Bob eluded me. Until I heard he was riding with the wild bunch. So we kill him, Bob. Wonder where he lives. Who's this a train? Let's see how this works. I'd been on their trail for months, ever since they left their hideout in the Bighorn Mountains. Out Led by Butch Cassidy. Mind. They were a loose association of outlaws who robbed banks and trains from Colorado to Montana. Among them was the Sundance Kid and that murderous hombre I was tracking, Roscoe Bob Wait, Bryant. I'm you were part of that giant Pop Pinkerton out. posse after the Wild Bunch? No, boy. A circus like that would have slowed me down. Besides, I wanted Bryant all to myself. They blew the bridge with the intention of forcing the train to stop. Oh. Well, I assumed the Wild Bunch was likely in the still intact part of the train high above. I was determined to make that yeah, son of a bitch fire. Bob pay for what he did to my brothers. You're not in the train? Oh, cool. I found a horseshoe. That'd be cool if it just falls down. Yeah. I don't even fuck with that shit in real life. Uh -uh. Get a bladder gun. Ooh. It's short and stubby. I like it. My ears are still ringing from blowing up that bridge. What'd you say? I can't hear it. Oh! Well, I made my way off That's unscathed and came upon a few oh, members of the gang and had no choice but to dispatch them. From there, Fire I had to negotiate an even I'm more horses. precarious route. But first, horse. I would Dang. need to get my Dang. ass out of there. Dynamite. Get some dynamite. Look what you got on you. I like my six shooter. Pretty cool. Look at the bird. Well, we not going hunting. from the frying pan into the fire as the train was clearly fixing to fall. Well, I old dynamite in the train. I had found the gang, but in order to find dynamite. old Bob, I needed to fight my way forward past a whole passel of desperados. Oh, I'm gonna break it open. Outside, inside, any way I could, I made my way towards my prey. Well, what about the passengers? It was mostly a freight train, as I recall. There were no passengers aboard that day. I like this game. <laughs> yeah, blow it. As That's I mentioned before, I am not it. fond of heights. But I was too busy dodging bullets to worry about falling to my death. Well, worry about falling to death. What's in here? Oh, nothing. Odds were I was likely to die that day anyway. 
So I was determined to take down as many of those bastards as I could. Bill Ow! I didn't know he was up there. Ooh, I love the shooter. Let me reload my shotgun before I go off the edge again. Oh. Times it was like shooting ducks in a shooting gallery. The only difference is these damn ducks shot back. Ooh. Have a present. Oh shit. I fucked up. Train don't exist no longer. Oh. Where do I climb? Oh, right here. It's like, what? Climb? I don't know what that I is. I kept hoping the law would show up and give me a hand. You mean like that giant Pinkerton posse that I read about? Did they come riding in? Guns a blazing to help? Guys, one level up those two things real quick. Oh, I gotta do this shit again. My double barrel scatter gun. Oh shit. Kid Cuddy. Kid Cuddy. That's all I see, Kid Cuddy. Help? From the Pinkertons? No, son. I had oh, to fight the by wild myself. bunch all by my lonesome. As usual. They despawned. Who the hell is that? Yeah, shot right in the back there, boy. Shot goes pretty far where I'm from. You want to go then? Hope not. Okay. Long button. My guess is those dime novels didn't portray this as it happened, did they? Only a few stragglers were left. I had to cut them down pronto if I was gonna stay on old Bob's trail. I always had a use of the guy on my gun. And St. Gettysburg. The uh, enemy of my father. If you wanna live, you gotta die trying, boy. Yeah, I don't know who's shooting at him. <laughs> me anymore. There's so much shit. Because I have God no God. Once I silenced all those guns, I went searching for my nemesis, determined to finally have my justice. But the only survivor who way. welcomed me was George Flatnose Curry. Who is he? He's the fastest nobody. gun in the gang. Right after Sundance, I mean. And Kid Curry. And maybe Elsie Lay. Though some folks might dispute that. Man, he sucks. You tell him to stop moving. I don't like it when he moves. I'm gonna grab for your gun. I'm about to shoot you right between the... The eye. I, I shot him! And then he shot back. I was supposed to shoot multiple times. I know I was trying to dodge it too. In real life. God damn. Stop fucking moving. I focus on two things at once. And that's you and this gun. Oh, bro, for you gun. He just too good. Might as well just put my grave 
my grave on. Put me in my grave while I'm singing my song. Like a rodeo, let's see how this goes along. If this guy wins one more time, I'm cheating. So it's going blah, blah, blah. Twice that's happened. I kill him, he kills me. Then that's not how the story goes. One of us has to live. I just gotta cheat. Uh, die and disarm this. I'm on. I just wanna. I just wanna win this so I can do a couple more. On that very same Shy day, Butch on. Cassidy and the Sundance Kid decided to leave the Wild Bunch behind and decamp for South America. South America? Damn. I shot that motherfucker in the arm. He's still alive. Just his arm hurt. They ended Look, up living down there for many years, but I'm sure you already know all about that. 